Hello, this is not a spring chick. You think you have bad days? How would you like to be the president of the United States? And everybody knows when you have a bad day. Oh, wait a minute. It wasn't a bad day. In fact, it was a fabulous day for the president of the United States as well as the unions. Meanwhile, well, actually, you know, the great part is then they can spin it, right? Well, meanwhile, we're going to bring old Cam on with comments on the headlines of today. The president spins loss. Oh, I got a cover. Rex and Bill O'Reilly can't understand how this could have happened. Um, okay, the President of the United States is claiming this was a great day for his policies and it proves that they are working because the voters came out and reaffirmed that unions are needed and that the President and Scott and that, and that the Scott Walker is on the wrong track. They said if Walker had have listened to the president and the labor unions, there would have never been a need to spend the taxpayers' money to show the strength of the president's policies and the labor unions. Uh, they said the president got skunked yesterday, and the unions basically, oh, we were outspent. Well, they spent 42 billion, 42 million to the Republicans, 29 million. Mm -hmm. So you know that's the way it is in politics. And G7 to hold emergency Eurozone talks, and Spain is the top concern. Oh, yeah. They have Not Greece? No, uh, well, because Greece is going to hold another election, and they're hoping that the people will come to their sense. The trick is, it's nothing. They're going to hold, and every time they hold something, they come to no conclusion, and therefore, the, mar the market is up to date on the, oh, well, Bernanke is going to approve the printing of more money, which means it makes our money worth less. And, uh, and, uh, and he also is going to approve dropping interest rates even lower to get people to buy, which they aren't buying. And uh, they're going to do all sorts of things in order to make the economy rebound. So on all of this news that we're going to be printing more money we can't cover, we're going to be spending more money we can't pay for, our market rose today. Isn't that amazing? Mm -hmm. And will schmoozing matter come November? Not, well, no, because the way it works. Well, not if they're not one of the candidates. That's right. He's not one of the candidates. Yeah. Right? He didn't win it. That candidate did not go. Hey, but don't worry. I'm going to guarantee you that the Democrats have said they're not going to elect yesterday's elections anywhere in the United States. They, oh, they got their asses kicked on every ballot issue that was important to the Democratic Party yesterday. And they're not going to let that stand. They're going to challenge every single one of them in the courts. And Pilot takes off on first solar-powered intercontinental trip. I know, that's ridiculous. I mean, you know, you can't fly around the world on solar power. Because um, if, if you happen to have, if, you know, you've got to fly above the clouds. And if you don't get above those cloud coverages, mm -hmm. Rescuers expect Nigerian plane crash toll to rise. No, and I won't. They're not. Everybody's dead. They're all dead. They cried. The plane went like a bullet into the ground. And North Korean officials executed in staged accidents. I, oh. I, okay, I know. They, I love that. They executed somebody and made it look like it was an accident. <laughs> they all know he was executed. But that's what they're doing now because they're, Obama said, they need to become. Community, citizens of the community, and they're going to do that by executing by accident. You accidentally offended somebody, so you and your family were gunned down in a hell of bullets accidentally. And Ed and Pat's and the history of missing kids on milk cartons. I know it's, um, you know, so they, they, they can't prove anything out. You know, some some guy that's dying and see now makes a, a statement. They can't find any body. They'll just toss the guy out. After nobody, you do not solve murders after almost 40 years. It never happens. And Bud weakens to tropical storm off Mexico's coast. Yeah, I know. We're looking for more rain, you know. Oh, really? We're, yeah, lots and lots of. Actually, it bypassed us because the winds were so heavy that the storm went right over the top of us. We got some sprinkles, but that was it. And Obama's high school pot spoke pot smoking detailed in the new book. Well, I know. The guy was a cruddy, he was a flat out criminal. He shouldn't, if he'd have been arrested like he should have been arrested, he would never have been allowed to run for public office. Mm -hmm. So it's a, uh, he was given, they said, oh, I got to cover this. They said this man has been given a free ride since he was a kid. All because of the color of his skin. Well, let's put it this way. 
I would, would play Cowboys and Indians when I was little. I played the half breed, which wasn't trusted by anybody when they had the games. Mm -hmm. uh, Obama only got, you know, well, I, you know, anybody heard the term, you know, from the Jeffersons called zebra? That's what Obama was. He's just like me. But because he was dark skinned and I'm light skinned, he was given everything that he ever wanted in his life, including the presidency of the United States. I know, imagine that. Yeah. And Chocolate Company creates 18.239 pound at my temple. Oh, actually, we saw, what was it? We were in Las Vegas. I was just thinking about that. And we saw some god awful. It was a dragon. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> we want the fudge right, so. Oh, actually, we do need to bring that up. That was a chocolate dragon. Yeah, well, we stopped to take pictures of that monster. I mean, that, what was it, like a thousand pounds or something of chocolate? Oh, it's just amazing. Faking a smile, this MIT software can tell. I think you can fake, it basically, if you look like it's a plastic smile, you know it's a fake thing. You does. usually can tell. So, okay, are they, like, checking photographs to see if they're fake or not? I guess so. They're probably trying to see if they've been, um, you know, uh, photoshopped to see making something that isn't oh. there. And Jeb Bush will consider a VP offer very carefully. Yeah, like it's not going to happen, folks. Okay, yeah, okay. He's behind Scott Walker, and, and Scott Walker has no chance of being named a VP because if Walker becomes VP, it basically hands another. Uh, thing that they can go after the Republicans on. Walker will be, yeah, okay, they decided, they made the announcement, they're going to go after Scott Walker and his family. They're basically, his kid is having a high school graduation this week, so you can bet they're going to, the unions are going to be basically trying to bring a halt to the high school graduation because Democrats are bad losers. And Bill Clinton parts with Obama on extending Bush tax breaks. He said you got to extend them for everybody. He said, you know, he, Okay, we're going to try to put it in a simple thing. Who are the billionaires in our, who are the majority of the billionaires in our country? It's a quiz. It's who? Democrats. Who are the majority of the millionaires in our country? Oh. They're Democrats. Uh, who owns the majority of the big businesses in this country? The who? Democrats. So therefore, if you want to put money into Bill Clinton's pocket, you'd better extend those tax cuts because he's in the group that gets the biggest chunk. And Mississippi man executed for killing four children. Well, they didn't want to do it because the Michigan, basically, they fought to the very end of what, you know, because the kids deserved it. You know, if you get killed by somebody, you deserve being killed because you caused the person to do it. Mm -hmm. The person that did it should be allowed to walk the street unless you're a Republican, then you go to jail and get executed. And photos, Venus crosses sun for the last time until 21.17. It'll happen again, it's just the, the way it crossed, because it, because we circle it, that it will happen again next year. It's called every 365 days you actually do this at some point, so. It just crossed a little differently. Yeah. That's all, right? Well, it was better, What ha it was a, a problem, the areas that it crossed were better for taking photography than generally it is, so. And report of the first doctor to reach short shot Lincoln found. I know, and that's something. Okay, it, it's just people basically are really haphazard with um, with putting material up that is really important. I mean, they find things. They're finding things from you know back in the days of Julius Caesar that should have been better kept than they were. So. Mm. And Bill, oh wait. Human remains delivered to two Canada schools. I know. Oh, that sounds disgusting. Oh, I, mean, I, I think this porn star would basically, he killed somebody and sent their remains of, all over Canada. The guy, he's not going to get, okay, Canada had a death penalty, and they know he's a total loony because you, you cut somebody up and send him to people. He didn't even know who they were he was sending them to. Oh. Yeah. Yuck. And a Monty bubbleism from the Mark Twain of the Animal Kingdom. Said um, only in the United States, if you get your butt kicked, can you claim it was a victory for you? <laughs>